Welcome back to this side of 40. This is your girl Lou, and we are going to be talking about the Elf's new matte skincare line. Um, and I definitely, definitely wanted to talk to you guys about it. I've been all over the YT here, and I've seen it in other places. And I definitely can honestly say, as far as their new mattifying skincare line, I am loving it. Now, the setting spray is something you definitely have to shake because there's a powder that collects at the bottom and you definitely have to shake this up before you use it or it will put a, a white cast on your face and it's like a little white kind of sprinkle-y things like looks like confetti or something um and this does um give your skin a very good matte look to it now the clay that's in here is what causes that white cast or whatever, the little sparkle, sparkles or whatever. Um, the fragrance on this is, I'll be honest, not the best, but I can honestly say that this mist is amazing. Now they say it's a blotting mist. Um, I definitely would say use a blotting powder but the mist does work really really good as far as setting your face i i just couldn't see it working as a blotting like something to blot with because i didn't feel like it, it sucked up enough oil for that and then they're clay and they have a a matte oil control mask now this mask has that same clay in it and tea tree this does definitely do everything it says it's gonna do so i definitely would say if you have the excess time in the morning and you can use this every time you're gonna do your face and you're one of those girls like me who's very very oily i've had this on for at least six hours now i definitely could say that this will help calm it down i am usually fairly um, moist because i have personal summers and it's not really like oily skin it's more like sweating so definitely can say that this helped throughout today and I would definitely repurchase now the next part of the system that I was so impressed with was their primer and their lotion now this lotion is it's a matte this does control the oils it still has that tea and the clay in it and the fragrance on these products, that's the only downfall to this product, is the fragrance, honey. The, the tea tree part, if it was just the tea tree fragrance of this, it would be perfectly fine. But it's the aftermath of the clay that, um, the mixture together, mm -mm. However, if you can get over the fragrance, it is an amazing product. Now, today I used the primer and then I used the primer putty. I used the two of them together and I can honestly say my forehead is not half as shiny as it usually is by the end of the day. And I'm constantly touching my hair. So, and I'm just one of those people who likes to touch their hair when I have new hair on. So, definitely these two together are amazing it does give you that matte like i don't look overly greasy the little shimmer you see is all highlighted i even highlighted my forehead today for the first time and even my nose and i can honestly say i was able to do that because this got me mad enough now their blotting powder and i'm just gonna say it out loud because a lot of people have been talking about this this blotting powder does put a white cast on your skin and it does cause flashback if you put it over your makeup however i set my primers with this and i'll be honest with you i feel like it held up a lot better because of that so um if you tried it let me know how do you feel about it did it hold up for you all day would you recommend it to a friend i definitely would recommend it to anyone who's subscribed to my channel because this product is line is very affordable i believe for all of the products it was less than 40 dollars 
and I got two free gifts with it. I got a hand sanitizer and a lip palette from e.l.f. So it was definitely worth the spend. And I had free shipping. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the link below. And if you haven't had a chance, go ahead and subscribe. I'll see you next time on This Side of 40.